Okay, um, well, this session isn't so much continuation. Um, okay, <clears throat> welcome back. Um, this session isn't related to any of the training programs, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to answer some of the questions um, from the beginning of the course rather than wait until the end and start asking questions. Um, I got uh, a few emails and some people said why learn programming or what's, what's the benefit of programming. So I'm going to answer these questions so at least some of you would have the motivation and the goal to, to learn the languages that I'll be teaching. Why learn programming? Well, if you're looking for a lucrative career or a, a career that's hugely in demand uh, across the globe, it's not just in one particular country, just across, across the whole world, there is a demand for programmers at the moment. So if you're someone that's looking for an opportunity or a job or maybe starting your own business, that's one reason. So the first reason is income. If you're looking for an income, uh, programming is a good um, career if you want to pursue it. Um, the second reason, well, if you want to create your own website, uh, maybe you've got an idea in mind and you're not really sure how to get started, instead of actually going out there and uh, looking for a programmer, um, which I did do in the past, big mistake, um, you would at least have an idea of what's involved in the project. At least you would be able to guide the programmer um, in, into exactly what needs to be done, or at least you can delegate the job to several uh, different types of developers rather than just giving the whole project um, to, to one person and they could just go off with the idea or um, at the worst case maybe overcharge you for the work. So you have to be very careful. So if you come across as someone that doesn't understand the trade, they will just take you for a ride. That's unfortunately that's the that's the real world for you. So the best way to do this is for you to get educated in the field. So the second thing is knowledge. All right. Um, third reason I can think of for learning programming it will actually help you with other subjects that you might be studying it's it's good for uh, the mind you know it's, it's just the way uh, programmers think they organize in a certain way uh, they think methodically um, so it will help you if you are studying other subjects as well it, it's a bit like mathematics you know you, you keep your mind active same thing with programming, it's fun. So the third reason I'm going to put down programming is fun. Is fun. Okay? So that's out of the way. Um, what's the next question we should answer? Right. The next question I'm going to answer which language should you learn first? Well, you've heard of C programming, you've heard of C++, um, you've heard of C Sharp, uh, how do you do Sharp now? Like that, yep. Um, you've heard Java, right? So all these, these different languages, um, what else did we hear of? Uh, JSP, um, we heard 